So I didn't plan on becoming a photographer. I actually started out in nursing, and then I transitioned to physical therapy assisting. Further down the road, I became involved in entrepreneurial ventures. Sea glass jewelry design, videography, and lastly, landscape photography. You could say that I'm multi-passionate for sure. The one common motivating factor for me is to help people in some way, whether physically or emotionally. After a cancer diagnosis, I discovered the healing power of interacting with nature. I realized that when I was outside, tuning in to my natural environment, I felt happier and more at peace. I also noticed that when I was creating videos for my clients or my YouTube channel, I was enjoying taking the photographs as much, if not more, than actually filming the videos. My friends were very complimentary about my photographs. They even purchased some of my photographs as prints for their home and as gifts for their friends. I feel so lucky to live in a place that has so much natural beauty. I knew that if I wanted to pursue landscape photography, I wanted to attempt to capture the coastal beauty that surrounds me so that others may enjoy it in their own home as well. I've become passionate about landscape photography. It's a win-win for me. It allows me to be outside in nature and forces me to tune in to my natural surroundings. I need to determine where the light is, if there is any. Is there wind? What will my main subject be? When I'm on a photo shoot, I'm focused on my environment, not on my to-do list or anything else that's going on at home. For me, it's mentally freeing, and sometimes I end up with a photograph that's worthy of sharing. And even if I don't, it's about the experience. It's always worthwhile for me. Another benefit of landscape photography for me is that it's something I can do by myself naturally introverted and being able to get outside and photograph a location without being dependent on anyone else is nice for me. Of course, if you want to make some money with your photography, you need to market yourself. That's where I fall short. This definitely does not come easy to me and I'd much prefer to hide behind my photos that I post on social media, but I know it's a necessary evil. I need to get out there, I need to speak to people, I need to network. I'm definitely a work in progress, but I'm loving the journey and I hope you'll follow along. Sign up for my monthly newsletter for behind the scenes footage, updates on new prints, and surprise discounts. Take good care.